Mayor Clayton runs the town of Wellspring to the east, and I've got to get a message to him. And you, you're the only one that can do it. Our supplies are getting low, and the mayor's promised help. We need to get restocked before the bandits cut us off again. Can you make the trip? I knew I could count on you. Remember, you ain't got any guns on that buggy of yours. You run across any bandits, you get away as quickly as possible and get to town. It'll be safer there.
You knew? Hold it there, pal. The bar isn't open to drifters. You want a drink in this town, you gotta pass muster with the mayor. If he's cool with you, then we all... Will you look at how you're dressed? So if you see him around town, why not stop? We've always got space for new races. Hey, my friend. I must say, you do look like a racer if ever. Greetings, stranger. <laughs> you look like a racer to me. Hey, you ready to try and win some racing? Welcome, friend. Name's Carl, but seems like everyone calls me Slim. <laughs> Funny, huh? All right, the deal is, if you want to race, you talk to me. Now, just take a look at all the events we have here, find something you like, and assuming you meet the requirements, then you're in. All the prizes aren't racing certificates, you know? Good to get new vehicle upgrades at Rusty's. <laughs> You new in town? Well, I got everything you need to keep your vehicle working, right? Now listen, I only take racing certificates for any upgrades or parts, and you gotta win those on the racetrack, nothing else. So if you want to deal with me, you best see Jackie Weeks first. He's always on the lookout. seen anyone dressed like that in a long time. Stranger, huh? <laughs> yeah, you do look pretty strange. Welcome to Wellspring, stranger. Best little town this side of what passes for civilization and a few good safe miles from any authority outposts. Nicest people you'll ever find live right here. Friendly folk. Not your wasteland bandit scum. Good honest people. Well, enough with all that. So I hear you have a message from our friend Dan. Let's have it then. Having some trouble with bandits in the settlement again. Dangerous life out there. Deadly even. Well, I can get all this stuff he needs. Gonna take some time though. Not sure how long. He must really respect you to give you this important job. So for now, I'll trust you too. You can stay here in Wellspring while I'll get his supplies, but not dressed like that. You'll bring the authority sniffing around, and I sure don't need that. So, you'll need to lose the Ark suit for something a bit more modern. <laughs> Go see the vendor in town. Get some new clothes. I don't care what you do with that suit, as long as. Good! Glad we understand each other. When you come back, we can have another little chat. Greetings. Name's Jackie Weeks, and I'm the Empresario who runs all the high-speed races in Wellspring. And I do mean all. If you're interested in testing your skill, you can go talk to my business associate over there, Slim. He can get you all set up to race. And do come back if you feel the need for some speed. 
Interested in winning some racing certificates? Good luck. Welcome, race fans, to another exciting Dusty 8 event. Interested in winning some racing certificates? fans, it's a scorcher out there today.
check out what races are available. See you again. Parts for sale here. Care to browse my selections? Drive like you mean it, friend. Care to look through the list of events? Good luck! Check out what races are available. Drive safe. Ladies and gentlemen.
Care to look through the list of events? See you again. Parts for sale here. What you looking for? Drive like you mean it, friend. People always going missing, and I don't think mutants are getting them either. Something. I haven't seen anyone wearing an ARC suit for a long time. Mm -hmm. <laughs> a man from the past walks through my door, goes to show you that no one needs nothing around here. But let's first talk about that suit you're wearing. I can take it off your hands for a fair trade and get you something uh, a little less, well, noticeable. Each of the suits possesses unique characteristics. It's up to you to decide what works best for you. sell all manner of goods here. Care to trade? doing business with you? You best keep slow.
Didn't the authorities say it had stabilized the cost of water? Well, let some me give technology? you some advice. Your reputation is everything here. If people don't know you, they don't like you. And you've got to earn their respect. Best way to do that is by making the road safer. Simply stated, destroying bandits. Makes people like you and brings business into my little bar. So I'll make a deal with you. Every bandit car you destroy in the wasteland, I'll reward you a little. I'll make money. You make money. We got a deal? Excellent. I think you're learning how things work around here. Well, if it isn't a stranger from nowhere, care to try your luck at a game of cards? So this here is a simple game of cards. <laughs> it's an easy game to pick up. It can take a lifetime to master. Okay, so here's how we play it. You start with your very own deck of cards. That's right, your deck. And from that deck, you can pick the cards you think will be the best to play. Bit of chance. Great racing today. That's much better. Now you look like any other good, hard-working citizen. But we got another problem. You see, you can't just leave your vehicles parked outside my town. We're civilized here. We have rules. And since it looks like you're gonna be here a while, you're gonna need a place to park your stuff. Go see Mick across the way in the garage. He can help you. Got that? After you talk to Mick, Go see Sheriff Black. He should have Dan's supplies all set by then. <laughs> You're gonna like our Sheriff. Cheers, friend. Pardon? Racing is the one thing people still got that's entertaining. Parts for sale here. Care to browse my selections? Drive like you mean it, friend. Go see Jackie Weeks. He's in the back of town. You can't miss him. Just look for the big inflatable gorilla. Well, well, well. How'd it do to you? And what can Mick do for you? Oh, a garage? Well, you've come. To 